As the high school volleyball season heats up, the hottest team around these days is the hard-hitting Pearland Oilers. The Oilers establish themselves as a statewide force to be reckoned with in the prestigious 86-team Pearland Invitational, finishing third overall against the field of the state's top volleyball programs. It was amazing because nobody really expected us to go that far. I mean, we always hope like, oh, we're going to go high, we're going to go high. But then on the second day, we all really played for each other, and it was really amazing to be a part of that, and it was awesome to like that early in the season to experience that. We got a, this team has the most talent I've ever had for sure here. Um, I think as the season goes along and we become more seasoned, uh, we're going to be able to step on the court and believe that we can, well, we do right now anyway, believe that we can beat anybody that we play. The talented lineup features a pair of Division I commits, including super sophomore Brooke Botkin. The six foot two outside hitter committed to national powerhouse USC even before her sophomore year of high school. It's always been my dream school since I was little. Um, even when I played soccer, it was a good school for soccer too. But um, I really like the weather up there, and of course it's in California, and the coaching staff is really good, and the opportunities it provides. So I'm really excited about that. And as Oilers head coach John Turner sees it, Botkin ultimately could emerge as the best player ever to come out of Pearland High School. Yeah, very talented young lady. Uh, like I said before, we saw her when she was younger, and just, you know, I just knew in my mind she was going to be really good real quick. And I think as we progress along, more eyebrows will be raised and they will see really how good she is. And, and, and I know her. Her work ethic is incredible and she'll just get better and better. Meantime, the Oilers also boast a dynamic outside hitter in senior Cassidy Newsman, who will play collegiately at Northwestern University. Cassie knew some, I mean, all of our kids, I mean, everybody, all 11 play for us. And I think that's what the great thing is, is the camaraderie on this team and the cohesiveness to be able to work together. Um, you know, everybody's giving some part to us winning every time. How good is this team? Oh, we're really good. Um, we put a lot of confidence in each other. I think that's what really sets us apart is we really trust each other. And we know that, uh, that each of us is going to do our job every single time we step on the court. And as the Oilers continue to excel on the court, they will settle for nothing less than the school's first ever berth to the state volleyball tournament. We want it more than anything. We have, this year, we really believe that with all the talent, all the height, that we can really push through and get to state and win it all. Three, one, two, three.